Gemini, welcome. How are you? Let's see what messages we have for you today concerning love. What messages do we have for the sign of Gemini concerning love? Knight of Cups, wow, the chariot. There's definite movement here. King of Pentacles, wow, death card. Releasing something, judgment. Wow, very, very powerful cards here. Big energy shift. Decision coming in. Knight of Wands. Ten of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. Wow, Knight of Swords. I feel somebody's going to come rushing into you and express their feelings. There's, there's a, this is a general reading, and these energies can work vice versa. But there's, there's a big, there's a desire here to express feelings. For some of you, there's distance here in the, in the challenge situation, the chariot. But there is progression and movement. I'm getting a connection that you thought was dead is about to be resurrected. Or because of free will, an attempt to resurrect it. Yeah, there's... There's a desire here to express feelings. At the moment, the feelings are being contained about this situation. But there's a desire there. There's a desire to follow your heart. Move on. Yeah. It's just a question of getting the information on how to do it and perhaps even making a physical journey and walking away from your present situation, you know, physically. Messages coming in. Pentacle energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Stability, security. I'm getting you want more information before you move. At the moment, there is a desire to go, but or there will be, but it's you're staying put because you want to know more. You want to know more about it before you move. Yeah, this hangman death card. There's big energy shifts here. Um, with the hangman, it's, you know, letting go of something big in your life. Letting some, yeah, letting something physically grow, grow. Letting something physically go to move on. And I feel one, you know that once you make this decision, there's no going back. You know, if you make the decision to sacrifice this, then you can't go back. Once the once it's made, it's made. There's no return. Yeah, communication. Well, I'm getting here a revival of a. A connection that you thought was dead or finished, gone, done, dusted. Judgment. There's the punchline. Justice. Making that decision. I feel because of the major energies that's behind this you are being divinely guided and 
here in comes the free will getting your you have the chance to receive your karma now for a few of you i am getting you're waiting on a legal decision so that you can move from somebody in authority by courts the justice system but i feel here that you're waiting for for a few of you you're waiting on an official decision before you can move on on this connection I do see a sudden desire to travel though, yeah. Yeah, an emotional uplift. Book a holiday, get away for a couple of weeks or go and see this person. Kind of like revitalise yourself. Yeah, I'm also getting that this person could just as well come and see you. But there's travel here. I'm getting travel. <laughs> Another travel card. This person could come and well see you. And also I'm getting from this that this person that you're dealing with wants to take this connection further. They want to go all the way, not necessarily marriage, but living together and, you know, generally stabilising the situation between you two and bringing the connection onto a much more solid footing. Yeah, you could be dealing with fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sag, or somebody with fire in their chart. You know, this this cycle ending, this burdensome cycle. You've been carrying this for a while. I'm getting, you know, emotionally been carrying this for a while. It's been kind of dragging you back. But there's that Ace of Pentacles. The chance to put this connection on a solid foot in, and you know, drop this heaviness, drop this emotional heartache and, you know, find new direction with this person. It's kind of like unshackling that old ball and chain. Yeah. I can see a sudden decision here, having the confidence knowing what you want, being comfortable with everything around you, being comfortable with the situation and just making a sudden decision and just committing and going for it. That's what I'm picking up from this reading. I hope that's helped you and I hope to see you again very soon. Bye for now.